Hey there, what's going on? Um, I'm doing okay. I had my uh, second knee replaced December 21st and uh, came home from the hospital on Christmas Eve. Been having outpatient therapy at home, uh, physical therapy. And you have to be on a blood thinner after you have that kind of surgery, I guess. And so I have a nurse that comes in twice a week and checks my blood and makes sure that the blood thinner level is right. Trying to get the glare off the glasses without having to... Eh, that's a mess. Anyway, um, I think I'm doing good. Um, this knee has been a whole lot better than the other knee. Uh, haven't had near as much pain. I have more mobility, more range of motion. Not mobility, but range of motion. Mobility sucks right now. I'm using a walker. But my range of motion is way better than it was after the, the left knee. Um, I was barely at like 70, maybe 70 degrees uh, this far out after surgery, after my left knee. And I've been at 90 and 91 this week with physical therapy on my right knee. Now it depends, like on one day I went to the doctor to get my staples out and um, the next day I was extremely swollen and so I was only like 85 degrees. But still that's way past what I was with my left knee. So I'm hopeful that this will be really go well the rest of the way through and, you know, be able to not have so much pain all the time. Um, Christmas was fine. Um, had a good time with family. They came here. Um, New Year's, pff, no biggie. Pff, <laughs> no drinking for me. Um, let's see. It's what today is the what, 8th. So I am two and a half weeks out of since surgery and I asked my PT if I could try using a cane yesterday. And I tried it and I went about mm, 15 feet and said, maybe I'm not ready yet. But I felt like the walker was just in the way some. And so she said, yeah, give it a whirl. But she said, you know, I, I said, I don't think I'm ready. And she said, you're not ready. It's going to create more of a limp if you try to use the cane right now. So I have to wait a little longer. That's okay. I can deal with that. My biggest complaint right now is these god-awful Ted hose that go clear up to my hip but roll down because they won't stay there. And they are the most uncomfortable thing in the world. It's like somebody's tied a rope around your leg half the time. You wake up in the middle of the night with that. That's just annoying as hell, you know. Heck, it's annoying as heck. Um, yeah, I'm fiddling with that right now. And... Of course, the room behind me is a total disaster, too, as is the rest of the house right now, but that's okay. It'll be, it'll, it'll be better soon. Anyway, I think I'm going to lay down and take a little nap because I'm feeling a little worn out. Um, I have to keep reminding myself it's only been two and a half weeks because I feel like, mentally, I feel like it's been a lot longer, um, but my body keeps reminding me that it hasn't, so yeah. Like, I want to go out, I want to go do stuff, I want to hop in the car and go somewhere. Yeah, hmm. my brain says go, but my my body says, take a nap. Take another nap. Oh, why not take another nap? Anyway, my pets are, are all hanging with me, and um, Jack lays on the bed with me all the time, and purrs, and Daisy lays against my um, unsurgical leg, and make sure I'm okay and Sebastian lays in the dog bed across the room because he doesn't want to be up on the bed with Daisy and the dog and the cat so it's all good anyway uh, I guess that's all I got for now I hope you're all doing well and I'll talk to you later bye